Nothing. It's Poof. We've got the book for a bunch of you literature freaks. Alright, I'll soon open. Cubus. I'm glad you asked. Crab, no, no, this again. So it happens you've got guts to return there with third rate writer with a fourth rate buck. What are you doing here, Nia? You got rejected. There's no more room for you in our club. This time is different. Our work of fiction would put your petty writing to shame. You inferior novelist. You'll pay for your pride with low rating from Paulina. Eva, be good and pass their book to me. Nia, are you angry at me? I just wanted to stay in club, you know. They would kick me out, you know. Get lost, Eva, and remain as Paulina's slave. I don't care. Worth reading. OMG, this book, this story is B. The best thing I've ever read. 
No way, it's impossible. Not even a chance that Nia could write something better than me. It must be a mistake. I'm going to slice those frauds if they copied some popular book in the process. I, I can't believe she changed this appalling storyline into something decent. This book from plot to characters to motives and well-handled romance. It will be my guilty pleasure forever. Can I read it too? Later Eva, now as they've proven their good taste in books, we need to keep our promise. Finally, move away from the central table, we need to access it. As the head of the City Book Club and the proud person of literature. Thanks to your book, I'll keep promise. My hand slipped into reality code and accidentally resetted our promise. As your book was so good, you can make another one, right? Club will be thankful. And I saw the trick in writing, it doesn't resemble anything Mia would do. It was you, Poof, and from now you're on a member of our club, greetings. How through it nope, it wasn't only me. Each of us added something to the story and would rather fight a reality warping act than going through this book writing crap again. Engage the club rogue racker. But the girls are so pretty, how I can fight against them. Bye. <laughs> 
But we did it. Reality Warpers are no match for us. You must take their dead bodies away. Okay. Can I do it? Snake melt, disgusting freak. The portal, it opened on its own. No, oh no, it's evening time. Soon night will fall and this timeline will end the same as our own. I worry that because of taking too many jobs today we won't be able to reach the sword in time. Wait, I've got a brilliant idea as there are so much of us in the party. Let's split up. We need three groups, one to go to Rusk, one through this portal under table and one to play zone. Hmm, but how I'm going to divide team into groups. Poof, can you pair me with India? It would be good to pair one responsible person with one irresponsible to make sure action is done. Who do you call irresponsible, you rogue or hacker? Great, you know it even before I told you, you're smarter than I thought. Hey, where are you going? I don't have any business here, my superior writing got exposed to the club. And I need to record few key talk dances for my audience fanfics are my secondary hobby. Er, but you haven't known the rule, if you join the party once, you won't be able to exit. Screw it. Alright, what if I will pair you with Cubis? I'm in. You betrayer, traitor over hacker, I will leave now, evolving through Irving Beach Beach. Stop screaming like newborn rat, you would only make fool of yourself if you go on a date unexperienced. As I'm the most responsible, I'll take you and Capcake to kill her guardian and do Rusk's business. So, I'm with Keelina. Oh well, Point World probably will be destroyed before we exit. All cool, said and done. Let us go. Be careful with Rusk, Void Worlds can be dangerous, however three people are probably enough to handle it. <laughs> 